Now listening to the In My Opinion podcast, the home of edutainment, brought to you by Sakali, DTM, and Uzuma. So get your drinks, snacks, relax, and enjoy. Okay, guys, welcome to the In My Opinion podcast. You know, I'm sorry for that protracted uh, introduction, but you know, my brothers, we're overexcited to yep. be amongst each other. We have no guests today, mm-hmm. just us, nowhere to run, nowhere to nowhere hide. To hide. I'm your boy Melinda the Fourth, aka Sukali. DT, don't talk, just listen. And your other Zama is a counterfeit. You can't tell by their outfit. Oh, hey. you worked on that one. Do you, you know what you've done? You've uh, trimmed it. He's yeah. trimmed it. Yeah. You took our I'm feedback. Glad my intro is, uh, you know, you know they have levels of hair. Uh-huh. It's at level no, four now. Four. Uh, level four. I'm hoping to trim it to level two. <laughs> two. No, that was yeah. like Weight Watchers. Mm. You've lost a bit of weight. Oh, wow. Mm. It, Oh, yeah, that, that yeah, left. yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. it was heavy before, now it's yeah. reduced in size. Oh, my, I know, oh, I get yeah, it, but yeah, it was, like, was a bit, oh, yeah, yeah, a bit dry. Yeah, okay. okay, how are you people? I'm fine, just fine. You seem like you're in a good mood, bro. Mm. I'm What's always that in a good mood. I don't know about that. Yeah, I think you're good. your skin is glowing. Is this Ava Estelle you've been using? It could mm. be, yeah, yeah. See? yeah. The winter pack. The winter the pack. pack. I see this one is my Manuka honey face mask. Where have you been using the face mask? Me, I'm come on, man, you know. Energize, energize. Energize, energize. I use the cleanser at night time. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah, then you put the mask on. Uh-huh. Then you wash that off. Oh, Tio. Uh-huh. Come on. Oh, and Tio. Then, <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tio. Uh-huh. I listen, I'm learning that. And then you moisturize. Levels. Yeah, then you moisturize. <gasps> Wonderful. Then you go to bed. When you wake up, uh-huh. I woke up like this. Come on. <laughs> skin glowing like so. Come on. You know, you go into some people's house, you see their skincare routine, you become mesmerized. Wait. Yeah. You don't know where to start. You but don't now, know what you want to pick up. I was watching Mary Musa, mm-hmm. her skincare routine. <gasps> she, wears, she wears gold. Then they have different apparatus. They, apparatus. What they, they, they scrub their face. Even, have you seen this one where they scrub the tongue? With no. like an apparatus, you put your tongue and you oh, yeah, scrape yeah, yeah. it. Oh, yeah, the tongue cleaner. Is Wait, serious? Yeah. That's why. Yeah. We need to up our levels. Up mm. levels, man. I actually think by the end of the year, we should all post a skincare, skincare routine. routine. Mm. That's a good one. You still. tie your towel. <laughs> yeah. Either you tie it up here like John Wick. You yeah. know John Wick? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, yeah, you know John Wick? He ties this one yeah, up here. With yeah, the bonnet. Yeah, yeah. Ah, with the bonnet. Yeah. Or you tie it down here and then you say, come with me to get my skincare. Yeah. Yeah. And then, yeah, I see that. Okay, we can do that. That one is That's our challenge. That's a Christmas present. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. To our viewers, by the way. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, do you know what? Should we just get into the dilemma then, since we are all okay? Come yes, on, let's skin get is in. popping. Popping. Kakati. Yeah, yeah. We Kakati. are here. Are you people ready? We are yes, ready. Uh, it feels weird when we don't have guests. Shoot up all of them. That's who I look. Uh, normally, yeah, we, we always throw everything to the guests. Yeah, 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 yeah. But now we're in the hot seat. Kakati. Are you ready? I'm mm. ready. I'm ready. Me and my boy. Mm. Me and my boy. He said, me and my boy. <laughs> <laughs> me and my boy. We got into a car accident. Yeah. And he's insisting I claim via my insurance company. Hmm. Sorry, he's insisting he to to make a claim via my insurance company. Hmm. But I think I should start again. So wait. Let me start okay. again. Yeah, please. <clears throat> me and my boy mm-hmm. got into a car accident. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And he's insisting to make a claim on my insurance company. So wait, were there two different cars? Yes, two different cars. Ah, mm-hmm. okay. Me and my boy were on our way to an event, but we got stuck in traffic. Mm-hmm. For one reason or another, <laughs> I'm even wondering. Wait, wait. <laughs> sorry, like, we can't be loving people sorry, that sorry. level. <laughs> sorry, go, on, go. On, Are you okay? I'm okay. It's okay. I'm all uh-huh. right. Me and my boy we was. <laughs> Did you want me laughing now, man? Me and my boy we were on our way to an event, but we got mm-hmm. stuck in traffic. Mm-hmm. For one reason or another, I lost concentration, and I bumped into the back of his car. Mm. I'll be honest, I was going about 20 or 30 miles per hour. Mm. Mm-hmm. So the damage was visible as his rear end of his car was damaged. Mm. Mm-hmm. Now, of course, I have no issue fixing his car. My issue is he wants to do it via my insurance company. Mm-hmm. Wow. Yet I offered to pay for his car damage on my next payday, which is in three weeks' time. Not, to, not so long, now. Not too long, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. The reason I don't want to go via my insurance company is because I was driving a company car. Ooh. And I do not want this reported to my company because mm. I will get in trouble. Mm. Wow. You know those ones, yeah, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Very big. It's not used for us. Especially where you're going. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Where were you going? Uh-huh. I was uh-huh. going to Donkey yeah, Sounds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> 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 I was going to recess. Yeah. Huh? Guap Gala. Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. 
uh, where was I? I was driving a company car and I don't want him to this report it to yeah. my company. Yeah. He's saying he wants to claim for his injuries as he suffered whiplash, hence why he wants me to claim via my wow. insurance. Wow. But how was he injured when he continued to go to the event and <laughs> stay there the whole night? <laughs> I feel my boy is being unreasonable and selfish, and I don't expect this from a friend I've known for over seven years. Wow. Am I in the wrong? Corner dance. Oof. <sighs> mm-hmm. Uzi, what say you on this one? Your it's friend. one, you know. Mm. I think he's... he's uh, as a man that has a company car. By the way, you have a company car. <laughs> mm. I don't know. I think I've gotten to a point where, like, with the whole insurance thing, I, I don't really care. If you mm. want to go for insurance, you go for insurance, innit? The mm. policy is... The way policy is going now, everything is going high, innit? So, it's, <laughs> it's not really... Okay. Because I, I can kind of get it from someone else's point of view anyways, yeah? Because for me, when it comes to company car, to a certain extent, like, people don't really care. They just... It's, it's, I don't own it. There's that difference to mm. when you own something and when you don't own it. You understand? And from what I know, anyways, a lot of the companies that these insurance companies use, they're like proper. They're not like the cheap, cheap, you know, like mm. just go, like, mm. you know what I'm saying? So I can get it from someone's point of view. Like, if obviously that's his personal car, depending on how much that car is worth, obviously you want to get things done properly in it. So, mm. yeah. That's, okay. But let, let me let me put a little. That's, that's just what I think. Let me like, put a little you know spice on it. Yeah. I get it. And put a little spice on it. Let's say... But I think, one thing, but I think because of obviously the situation that obviously it's a work thing and he might get in trouble. Yeah, so that's, that's, what, I'm saying, that's what I was going to say. So that, mm. that one, I think, yeah. Because I know some company because cars... Of that, you should kind of like just, yeah. You, you can have personal about, use. Some yeah, person, yeah, yeah. some company cars, you don't, innit? Mm-hmm. So let's say this is strictly for work. And you know how sometimes if that's his only source of transportation, some people just try let to... Let me just use it quickly. Them quickly, yeah, quickly, yeah, yeah, and yeah. then that happens. So what do you... Yeah, you still feel the same way, like, yo, it is what it is. No, 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 no. I think because of the circumstances, mm. that's why I feel like he should sort of allow it. But obviously, I allow get it. Allow it, what do you mean? Like, allow, don't, like, just don't go for the insurance. Fix the car. Because okay, obviously, yeah. if they find out that he's using that car outside mm. working hours, then it can be a problem, innit? Do you know mm. what I'm saying? For that reason. But obviously, I also get why... Maybe someone wants to go through the other way to get things done properly, innit? You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, I, for me, yeah. And I, I think I'm I'm with I'm with Uzi on this one as well, innit? So I think it's two ways, innit? Listen, if if you have personal use and you're fully insured via the company, then I can understand. Yo, because at the end of the day, like one thing people need to understand about insurance policies, yeah, the way, especially the way it works in the UK, bro. Even if you, if, if there's a claim, even if it's not your fault, the mm-hmm. fact that there's a claim and you was involved in an accident, your premium's going to go up anyway. Yep, right? Yep, yep. right? So it don't even matter. So my main thing is, of course, if that's the case, most people are always trying to get the full Monty, in it. Mm. <laughs> Do you know what I'm talking about? I might as well go, go high. Yeah, go high. Oh, so good. at least that way, if my premium go, goes up, it then at least that can, that can, um, you can put that to the side yeah, to yeah, cover yeah. the deficit, innit? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying to you? However, but... If it's a situation where you know your friend could potentially lose his job because of that, I think that's just a cost of friendship, isn't it? Do you know what I'm talking about? Mm. And you just got to, you know, let him pay to, to, to repair it. But obviously, and I know to like to use his point, like let's say you've got one of those high-end proper like, mm. you know, whips that cost a lot of money, mm-hmm. then maybe it might be a thing of like, yo, okay, cool, but I'm going to pick where it gets repaired, isn't it? Do you know what I'm talking about? You can come up with something like that. Okay, cool. I'm, I'm going to go to like a reputable um, repair shop and get them to do it properly to a good standard, innit? Do you know what I'm saying? Like, because who knows? He might be financing the car as well. Mm. So, do you By know what I'm talking way, about? That's a good point, and you might though. need to give it back yeah. within a certain type of period of time. And then now someone's gone, done some degger degger job. Mm. Do you know what I'm talking about? They might not so, check that like that, you know. I don't think you'd be surprised. Well, you'd be surprised. It'll you don't be you know. that one that'll check. No, obviously they don't check like that, man. But as long as if you're buying so, new cars off them, if you're t- swapping them, man, they just no. But yeah. if you're giving it back, you just never know, yeah, it? Because yeah, who wants to take that kind of risk? Yeah. Do you know what I'm talking I about? It, That's what I'm saying. So I mean, what do you think? My opinion changed, Van Dank. <laughs> Because at first, before Uzi spoke, I was saying, yeah, that's bad, man. Like, mm. let your friend pay for the car. Mm. But then he's mentioned something about it might be a big boy whip. Yeah. And being someone that has suffered. Like a car that you, like your own whip now. Remember when I told, I called you lot, when the London Marathon happened and the cone got under my yeah, car. Yeah, got under your car, yeah. And it was six bags to fix it. Mm-hmm. I would not want that car fixed anywhere else by, but B&W. But 100%. You know what I'm saying? Because 
the way the guy was talking, these different parts I've never heard of of a car. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he was talking this and this is leaking. This is, I was like, man, no. Imagine now you go to some Degga Degga dealer. You 100%. Know I, mean? I know even them places, they even remove parts. They don't even, they don't even fix your car. They remove parts and say the <laughs> car's fixed. <laughs> Next week, your parts are a new Euro trader. What's it? You know what I mean? So for me, now Uzoma said he's put, I've changed my mind. Mm. I think if, the, if, the, if it's a big boy whip, yeah, I think going through insurance is the best thing. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Obviously, he's my boy. Wow. So I'll try my best to find a reasonable middle ground. Hopefully, I'll be like, listen, if you can afford it, yeah, in three weeks' time, it. we're going BMW. Yeah, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. Or Mercedes or whatever it is. But the thing I don't agree on is him saying, oh, he wants to claim for whiplash. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. I think that, that one's a bit greedy. Do you know what I mean? Because mm, he went to the party as well. Exactly. You went, But then whiplash does come on the day after. That's what they always say. They always give it like, even sometimes they give you a week. Because <laughs> it's not just about your neck pain, everything. You have a flashbacks mm. of, you know, you have a, what is it called? Is it pro, post-trauma or what uh, you call PTSD. it? PTSD. Yeah, PTSD. You never know, so. Although the whiplash money is sweet, man. Nice. Listen. Yeah? Mm. I've eaten that money before, by the way. Yes? Yes, it's ah. sweet. I was, was you, I was injured, by yeah, the way. Injured. I was injured. But then, if the claim was purely for whiplash, then I think that's not a good friend. Mm. That definitely ain't a good friend, bro. I see what you mean. Because if you know your friend's going to get in trouble, but you just want to make a lick very quickly, then I, f I believe that you're, where do your loyalties lie? Mm. And you know money that comes easy, it will go easy. 100%. Just as it came. It will never mm -hmm. multiply. Do you know what I mean? And I, I don't feel, I don't see how you lot could even repair that sort of, especially because you know, innit? Yeah. Like, you know if your boy is trying to pull a fast one, innit? Exactly. So it's like, I don't even see how you lot are going to be able to repair that friendship. And we can never go back from there. I'm one mm -hmm. of those people, like, once you cross me like this, we'll never go back the same. Mm -hmm. So do, do, you, do you think it'll become like a, a beef thing or you think you're going to be like, still cordial, but like, I'm no, just going to keep my distance. Beef. For me anyway, it will never be beef. The age where I don't have time to beef anybody. But mm. now I know where I stand with you. Mm. I know how to move when I'm around you. I'll say, Seba, where do you want me your car to be fixed? Insurance, we go insurance. Because at the end of the day, you're not going to die. Mm. You get in trouble at work, they're not going to fire you, I, I doubt. They you might do. You, okay, maybe. Especially if you're using a car that that's it's another not, aspect. You're supposed actually. to be. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It might, it might not be covered under you're right, that. Innit? You're right. Especially imagine on a, on a, you work Monday to Friday. You're meant to yeah, use it, and then now you're going party actually. on a Saturday, mm. and then this has but happened. If, you lose, what, what, if I you lose know? my job from that, it's, it's mad. It's peak. it's peak. And all you're gonna get is what a bag. What's whiplash these days? Five bills. I don't even know. A bag. No, but, but no, but going to your point is not even a, put the whiplash to the side. Because going to it. your point, mm. you're saying if it's a big boy whip, and let's say like for example now they're saying yeah. Oh, it's gonna cost like eight bags to fix. I know whatever job this guy is doing. <laughs> and three weeks. A, and it's a, it's a three weeks. You don't think in three weeks eight bags are gonna cost? Eight bags. <laughs> you know so what I mean? Yeah, yeah, what I'm yeah, saying is yeah, like, yeah, so, yeah. but then you're saying you don't care. Like, so if he's telling you from what you're saying is that like, even if you tell bro, like, yo, I can't fix this because we have to go we got the quote. Bro. So yeah, and it, hundred percent. Wow, hundred percent, bro. It's a My, sticky one, you your know. Your suffering should not cause me to suffer, Van Nank. Yeah? So mm. you you haven't patterned yourself. You were distracted mm. while you were driving. Mm. You've now hit me. My car's damaged. I'm I'm trying to be reasonable, but if you can't afford it to do it on your own, what must I do? So so would you not would you not claim on your insurance for him? My insurance? Yeah. Are you alright? If if that saves him his job. This is a plot twist. Mm. Yeah. You yeah, didn't see that one coming, did you? So what do you say? You say, well, how do you even claim that one if someone has hit you from the back? What, he reversed into something or what? But you can well, take... He didn't fault. get his details. Yeah, you can just say he didn't get, uh, the didn't get details, details and whatnot, whatnot and they'll just, they'll just claim it against you. Ooh, you're push. the guy with the big boy whip, so you definitely, obviously, you're covered. But that's then he, he has to pay my premium then. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. So, yeah. so the, the point I was trying to drive at with that is like, yo, I feel like if it's someone's livelihood, yeah, at stake, like, and it's my boy, in it? Do you know what I mean? I'm going to try my best to try and work something out. Facts. Yeah, you might not be able to afford eight bags or, you know, whatever crazy cost might come with it. Okay, cool. We're going to do this. But end of the year, if my, whatever my premium goes up by, you're, you're nah, going to cover end that. end of the year? No, oh, no, no. Oh, leave me with a deposit. Well, you're not going to know, though. No, leave me a deposit. <laughs> a bag or something? A just, bag just, or something. Yeah. Because end of the year, you'll come, you'll start telling you other people's problems. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? You have to sort that at the, at the source. Yeah, but no, also, no, that's true. do you know what? I just feel like as bedrooms, yeah, brothers, mm. whatever. If you put your boy in a difficult situation, the onus is on you to come up with the solution, not him. A lot of people get in these situations, right? Mm. It might be car, might be something else. 
and they would just fold their arms because of loyalty. Ah, we've been boys for da 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 da. But it's like, no, bro, you just inconvenience me. So you now mm. have to help me out of the situation. Would you? Because with this particular situation, I don't think it's something that. Um... Okay, let me give you an example, right? I wouldn't class this. I think, I guess you take a situation by situation, innit? Let's mm. say, for example, your boy has come to. Like, I think, like, remember, like, the dilemma we had before is come to borrow your watch. Mm. Just to go to go stunt, yeah, mm. to take a girl out or whatever yeah, yeah, it might yeah. be, and, and he gets, gets robbed. robbed. Mm. Something like that is different, mm. right? But this time, you lot actually going happened. out, yeah. and it's unfortunate that yo, maybe you lot was speed and you stopped because mm. there was a traffic, and then he just la laps concentration, mm. and then boom, minute. So it wasn't done intentional. So mm. with that, it could you could have been somebody else. Do you know mm. what I'm talking about? Isn't it? True, right? So my main thing is that kind of situation is a bit different. I yeah, guess that's yeah. how I would look at but it. But then what it? would he have done if I was somebody else? He would have gone to insurance. Which is true. But lucky for him, he's his friend, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but it's different though. We can't say what would he have done, innit? Like, true, true. Only, like, like, you're that's right. not his bedding. So I actually that point, hate that. I hate when people can, do but that. But when it's your right. bedding, we can try to resolve right. this, innit? Mm. You know what I'm saying? So how do we resolve this for our brother? So for me, I, I don't know. Obviously, it depends on um, number one. I think it's like it's two folds in it, like we're talking about. Depends on um, the circumstances of his work car. Mm. If he's, he's allowed to use it For within his um, work, um, whatever mm -hmm. contract, whatnot. Yeah, like listen, just and if the damage is too much for him to fix mm. privately, then yeah, guess what? Go through the insurance. However, if uh, what was the other one? If, for example, what was the other one? Something just came into my head now. Go on. Let's go. They can actually, they can actually spin this whole situation. How? Uh -huh. Because I've hit my bread in here. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. We can say the thing happened on a Monday. Oh. The game. Oh, and the Don't say nothing. Uh -huh. I won't say nothing. Uh -huh. And we say this thing happened on a Monday. So you look and lie. <laughs> don't do that. Don't draw me out. You look and break the don't law. Yeah. Break the law. It's not breaking, no, but I hear you. I, I wear bridges, bro. I'm joking, to avoid yeah, the yeah. work to avoid situation. The issue. Ah. Don't say it was a nine a.m. in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, outside, my house, outside my house uh, no uh, camera uh, <laughs> said outside my house <laughs> uh, oh yeah that's true okay so just, I never thought about that one that's a good point uh, I guess I guess I think the, the theme oh, of this you, <laughs> they don't remove the life of the back of your head uh, but listen I guess the theme of this whole thing is like, listen, if that's your boy and if you don't really have a good relationship, yeah. mm. try and work together try and find to, as, as much as you can to not cause damage on either side. So it? at you know least I mean? now that's a fair, that's a fair combo. Isn't that's it? a fair, yeah. Save your job. Yeah, yeah, there you go. You save your yeah, job. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I can still get my claim. And you still get your claim. Yeah. Yeah. Ah. They're not come for me now. <laughs> <laughs> See, Uzi don't give a good yeah. resolution. That's there, it, boy. man. I think the case is solved. The case please. is solved. But please, don't. What do you think? Don't lose your friendship. But now you just talk about. Don't I feel friendship. like one of the issues with Mandem is we don't talk honestly to each other. Yeah. If you're boys for seven years, mm. to me, that sounds like a good friendship. Yeah, 100%. Uh, a brotherhood almost there. Eh? Mm. Why would you feel a way to actually be honest with him? Be like, bro, I don't know what to do in a situation. Like what you ask me for is mad. Mm. Because coming to people like us, it makes me feel like your friendship is not as strong as you think. Mm. Because I'd like to think if this situation happened to any one of us, I will come to you, man. Like you, bro. Like this is the situation. Ah, what no, we do? Sukali, man. Yeah. No, no. Because you will put you in the mood. Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> your first take. It was that yeah. Yeah. Your mood. His first take. <laughs> well, what do you think I'd do? Your man? first take. Was like, even talking already. That's now, what yeah. I'm saying. Feel, feel That's what I'm saying. Wait, what do you think I do? What do you think I do? Oh, I think you're gonna make us go insurance, bro. But you're gonna do it in a way that for the car you have. Yeah, oh, yeah, so Carl uh -huh. is making us go because me, I ain't giving you seven bags, bro. It's not. But I know what DT is gonna do. DT's gonna. I know a guy. He fixes all my cars. <laughs> <laughs> he fixes all my cars. Come to him, did it? I know like that, bro. Yeah, yeah, bro. I know that, but I know you're not gonna want to do that. And the thing is, I am paying BMW <laughs> <laughs> eight bags. <laughs> I hate them. No, I think I'll be reasonable, bro. Luckily, because actually, I don't know. I don't, bro. Listen, I think I definitely will be reasonable. But this bro. just goes to show that man, them are, bro. Man, them are going crazy over things they own temporarily. Bro. By the way, this is another thing. Do you know that? Facts. This car don't belong to you. It doesn't it's belong. It's different if you own it. It's mm. like, yo, like, this is like... My baby this car, car gonna, it? But My this thing is, everyone, the way, every, every, after three years, two years, they're giving it back. Getting it. But man, mm. them are actually fighting like, yo, this is... Do you know what I'm saying? I, mm. I think it's what, um, obviously, you got to think about it, especially like in our community. Yeah, I think it's about what, 
it symbolizes, isn't it? Mm. It's now more than just a car. For most people, anyways, especially if you've got like a nice German, everything is mm. now, it's a symbol state, isn't it? It's like something that's saying, yo, I'm that guy, isn't it? You know what I'm talking about? Mm. So now you're telling me I can't, I can't drive for another ex of man. Man, yeah. am I thinking about rather than thinking about the friendship? And you're you know still I'm paying about? the monthly fee. But see, you're I'm not driving you, the see car. what I'm talking about, Sukali? You see what I'm talking <laughs> you're about? You're not driving the car, but you're paying the monthly see fee. See what I'm talking about? Yeah. Well, you get a courtesy, though, man. How if we're not going for insurance? Oh, yeah. Exactly. Oh, but we've already solved this case already. The man. case is yeah. solved. It's true. What, what did you well, have your last one? No, but obviously, I think for me personally, yeah, this particular dilemma actually links into what I want to talk about today. Oh, okay. Right? Wonderful. And... Yo, it's your boy, Sukali, from the In My Opinion podcast. And I'm here to introduce our newest sponsor, none other than Ava Estelle. This skincare company was founded by a caring husband after he couldn't find a remedy for his wife's skincare problems and it cured hers so you know it's going to work on your skin. I personally use this to keep myself moisturized so if you know you want that soft skin, you know winter's coming, you got to stay moisturized, make sure you use this. It'll have your skin as soft as a baby's bottom. Check out Ava Estelle. And that is like, in terms of, um, what do you want to call it? Um, how to deal with um, different types of personalities, isn't it? In, mm. friendship, in the friendship circle, mm -hmm. right? And I think, like, even using us as an example, mm. right? I'll start there. Why not? I feel like, <laughs> you're so crazy. I feel like um, the way we communicate is very, very different. Very different, by right? the way. And for me, uh, is, is the situation, things have caused certain problems, mm. right? In the past, mm -hmm. where you genuinely feel like, yo... Like, I, it's crazy, because for me personally, yeah? Because I'm, like, in the middle... You of think, both of you two. You think I feel so? like that, yeah. And mm. I'll tell you the reason why. Because, like, I'm just giving an example. Like, when you talk about our communication can be mad, isn't it? Like, because Uzi sometimes is somebody that can be like, yo, he can just say something mad, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. In the heat of the moment. Yes. But because I've known him for so long, I personally, and I'm talking about that, I'm giving an example of like a situation that happened years ago. Remember when we was doing um the Ashra B thing for um Worm Tish? Yeah, yeah. Tish, yeah. remember, and you Tish. two had that mad argument. Oh, on the way to party. go, is it Kareem? Yeah, 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 Kareem, yeah, yeah. yeah. On the way to go and get measured. Remember, it was a mad thing. Remember yeah. that time? Oh, yeah. You I forgot. remember it. No, how can I forget? He, okay, you, you, you people you know that. Remember. I remember. You don't every... remember, but you, you want me to remember. remind you? <laughs> <laughs> you can, I don't remember. I can remind you. You, you, can, you can bring up after, but let mm. me. So the point I'm making is like where he said, he could say something mad, yeah? And the way you took it was so crazy. Yeah, but I took it personal. Good thing because I was there because I know him. Yeah. And I knew like it wasn't coming from a place of where you was, what you was thinking and how you was thinking, right? Are you cocksure? And I had to try. I was like, oh, come on, man. And I had to, that's the reason why we're still here today, though. Think about it. Because well, you I don't, understood. I don't, I don't even know what you are talking about. I've no, done no about I'm talking about the way. It's not about that. I just the use The perpetrator always forgets what he's done to the victim. <laughs> yeah? I don't know what I used it as an example because, bro, I'm talking about like, Friendship, yeah, I feel like what, what tends to cause a lot of problem, yeah, amongst friends, friends yeah, is like, is usually communication breakdown, right? Mm. Because different people have different ways of how they like to communicate. Like me and you right now, we can come to almost a blow, fam, yeah? We can do a mad argument, spin the whole place upside down, and tomorrow, yeah, me and him, these guys come to pick me up, we're, we're, we're back again, like, mm. like it was like nothing ever happened. And it's like, you two, or I can't even go there with you. Mm. Does that make sense what I'm saying to you? Yes. Just because don't of certain things. Yeah? Don't go there. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you bro, may not return. Really, bro, all right, let me, let me tell you something. Uh, yeah. I think when you talk about level of, like, tolerance, yeah? One mm. thing I know for fact, yeah? I can now get into blows with my brethren. The moment I've gotten into physical blows, there's no... I don't think you can come back from that, yeah? Mm, but right. in terms of, like, arguments, like, you can... Like, there's boundaries in it. I couldn't get upset and start cussing your mum or your, like... Yeah, but yeah. if you just say certain things to me, but I don't really care, bro. Like, my tolerance for them things are high, innit? You know what mm. I'm saying to you? But I feel like some people don't have that kind of tolerance, innit? Yeah? So Carly don't have yeah, it. Yeah, he don't. Mm. He don't. But that's what I'm saying. Some of the things he would take as wild, if he said that to me, I would carry on like he never said that. Do you know what I'm saying? So, you, you know what I'm talking about. So... What he, he don't classes as wild. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. We're different people. What he might class as wild, yeah. to me, is not wild. I okay. don't know. Like, like an example. Okay, example, yeah. Mm. I might say something to him, yeah. Like I've said to him in the past, but I don't trust you. Yeah. Yeah? 
Mm. He would take that and he's like, yo, I can't sleep, you know. He don't trust yeah, me. But yeah, he can say mad. that to Are me. Are you mocking, bro? No, no, but what I'm saying I can't me, sleep. No, 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 you can't sleep. He can say that to me. Mm. And I'm like, okay. You don't trust me, no problem. <laughs> but I just but that's, that's crazy, crazy That's though. crazy to me. No, but to you, it's but crazy. Are you not going to want to find out why no, you don't, I, I don't, you don't no, trust somebody? No, but what somebody. I'm saying to you yeah, mm. is, yeah, that's on, like, if you say you don't trust me, yeah, that's cool, yeah, but because of how I, I know who I am, yeah, mm. and I know I've not done that, I don't, I'm not going to lose sleep over it. It's not that mm. deep. Yeah, but, uh, but then, I, then, 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 mm. then it makes... It's different to me saying, oh, F your mom or F. That is wild to me. Mm. So maybe you have different. So that's your, That's like that your... there, If you said that to me, then it's like, bro, are you dumb? Kind of thing. But you say you don't trust me. Okay, what now? I'm still gonna get paid at the end of the month. Like, yeah, but then like, I don't understand. Do you, do you know what I'm nah, but I don't get what you're saying. Okay, cool. Because at the end of okay. the day, yeah, if yeah. you're close, but we have level. We have different levels of threshold, isn't it? Yeah, clearly. Because at the end of the day, if I'm bedroom with someone or mm. you're my bro, mm. and you tell me you don't trust me. That is a very serious statement, bro. Okay, so you're going to ask me why I don't trust you. Yes, yes. exactly. I'm going to need to know why you don't trust yeah. me and I'm going to need to know how can we resolve this because for me, I don't want to be sleeping next to someone that doesn't trust me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You, you might kill me in my sleep. I don't know. You're thinking it too far. No, no I know. But, but and then that, that, go on, go on. To me, that, that's, mm. that's how far it needs to go because mm. it'd be different if we were in high school, bro. We're big men. So for a big man to tell me he doesn't trust me, what have I done that has made you feel like you don't trust me? Mm. And you, you fail to answer. You start stuttering. No, I don't feel the answer. What well, do you mean I, I feel that, answer? that's something that's not been answered, by the way. <laughs> no, 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 we spoke but about wait. that. But okay, what, I, what, mm -hmm. what I said, what I realized mm -hmm. about myself is, mm -hmm. yeah, I, when, I, when I explain something, yeah, I use one thing as a general, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. If I say to him, so he can do something that I feel like, yo, so Carl is a bit, he's a bit weird when it comes to that. I will now rank <laughs> him overall that I don't trust him. Yeah, yeah, but yeah. But it's yeah. one specific thing yeah. which you spoke about. I told you. Or are you acting? Are you playing dumb now? I'm not playing dumb. I just so how come yeah, you don't remember? It's not playing dumb. No, no. But huh? I'm just explaining to you what yeah. my issue is that I've kind of. So when I, I when someone remember. does something, I put no. them in a bracket. Uh, yeah. So I just generalize the whole thing yeah, rather yeah. than just saying, okay, when it comes to this specific thing, I don't trust your judgment. I don't trust certain things. You yeah. get. It? So I don't split it into category. I just. And that's what I was trying to say to you that, that and remember I, saw, I had a conversation with you as well, which is what I was saying, and that's the reason why I brought this thing up about communication, isn't it? Yeah, which is why, because me, I know him, right? This is why I'm saying, like, yo, bro, that to me is like you can't say that to somebody, right? You can't say I don't trust you. Mm. That is like a very big statement, but genuinely. What you're talking about is that like, oh, you might talk about. I think there's a difference between saying I don't trust you to saying yo, I don't. I don't trust you to make that decision, mm. right? Those I don't know if that makes things. sense. These are two different things. But with you, with him, he would say, oh, general, like, oh, I don't trust Akali, you know? Mm. But then deep down, because then I asked him, bro, when you say to some, something so mad like this, yeah, why? Do you think um, if man that make it big, yeah, amen, he's going to steal the money? Like, do you think like, and then he goes, nah, do you think Sukali would just, like, will blow up and then he would just go about his own thing? Like, nah. So when you say you don't trust my man, what is it then? Then it's about, oh, certain things he, do, he does this way, I wouldn't do that way. But then that's not to do with trust, though. That's, that's creative about, differences. Yeah, there you go. You so know? again, that, that's, and that's why I talk about communication, isn't it? Like how he communicates certain things. And I, I can say, I don't want to just make it maybe single him out because I can say myself as well sometimes. They were getting to maybe, you, don't yeah, worry. Yeah, yeah, I know you lot can come to me as well. <laughs> maybe me as well, myself sometimes. The way I might communicate certain things might come out a certain type of way. And I feel like it's such a, it's a thing in a friendship that's very, very, very important. Mm. Otherwise, not coming to an understanding, especially where you have something together, like a business venture, wherever it might be, being on the same page communication wise is extremely important. Why do you think we struggle as men or even us as the three I people? think ego. Mm. I think sometimes there's ego and I think there's sometimes there's, um, I think what that ego then does is it, it creates like lack of, um, patience mm. to try to understand one another. Does mm -hmm. that make sense what I'm saying to you, innit? So sometimes in the heat of the moment, your ego and your everything is flaring up. You don't want to um, back down. Mm. I think that's another issue that we struggle with as well, especially when it's mad, somebody don't want to back down and actually, okay, well, let me just calm myself down. I, I, as painful as I know it is right now, let me actually think about this, innit, properly mm. and maybe take a certain approach to this. Or maybe, you know what, let's just leave this right now. Let me go and think about it and come back. Right, but I think too, too far, too often, we tend to stand on the same bullcrap. 
Does that make sense? What I'm saying to mm. you, like, bro, you you could be wrong. There's a middle ground here, yeah. But you don't want to to meet it. Some yeah. people just want to die on their hill. Yeah, mm? Mount Uzoma. I don't know what this hill is. Yeah, you know it very well. I don't know. I just think every different people have different threshold, innit? No, but I hear that. But I think you got to get to a stage, bro, where you understand that if you're working with someone, especially the way we're in business together, and we're friends, but we're in business together. I feel like you need to be able to understand that, okay, the way I communicate with Mulinde is not working. <laughs> yeah? Let me change it so that we stop butting heads. But what you do is you say, no, this is what it is. And so that means then I have to be the one that adjusts. And then what happens is mm. when you're the one that continuously makes the compromises, one day you get tired, Ben Nang. Mm. Yeah? So what, you're the compromiser now? Ah. Allow it, man. Wow. Allow you it, man. to compromise. Ah. Look at that. This guy, ah. when he see when when he has any evidence that I've messed up, he rejoices. Ha! Ah, I've caught this guy today. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you're, 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 you're you do. Man, I, like, I'm going to Stop. give it to him. Mm. I have caught him. I told you we can't trust Sukali. Look what he's done. Look what he's done. Are Whereas you're, you're capping, bro. Uh, I'm not capping. This is my truth. Yeah. yeah, I mean that, that's how it feels, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But when it comes to you, I feel like you're giving so much grace, no one does. so much understanding. Yeah, that's a lie, though. It's I not don't think this guy, bro. It's not bro. like wait, you, you don't are, give my no. no you don't turned give up no late grace, the last bro. three sessions here. Yet you bro. live five minutes away. But we've just said we, you're welcome. Is this true? Thank you for coming. Yeah, but I, I, I don't. Want, I don't want to get to my reasoning as to why. No, okay, so why do you feel like it's hard? Why do you find it hard to apologize when when you're when you're when you done so when you're wrong? Because I feel like man, them don't give you the opportunity to apologize. They just start moaning and yapping, 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 yapping. So I was like, okay. Wait, if man turned up, man, I've not come in already. They already mo I can hear man moaning from there. <laughs> no one was moaning. When you know me, when you ask for something, I'm not gonna give it from. Even if it's sex, eh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you see men yeah, yeah, trash. Just, too, right? eh? No, but, man. Uh, no, but real talk though, but why why is that? Is, is that not then ego? That then? If you know ego you're, you're wrong, if you know you're wrong, why can't you All just right, wait, wait, you know hold on? Hold on, hold on, hold on, one second, yeah. Mm. So if you say recording time is what time was recording meant to start? We're meant to start. It's not seven. that we're, we're supposed to be here at. Seven. I mean, no, we're, no, we're okay, supposed no, to be no, at seven o'clock, though. We're, we're meant to be at seven. Yeah. Doing what? This, you know what's mad? Yeah? Wait, wait, wait. You know, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm trying to understand. No, 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 no. I'm gonna address. This is what you do all the time, and that's one You're thing. You're the one that, that understands the no, communication. No, no, but, yeah. no, no. But it doesn't matter. Understand or not understand it, because me and him beef a lot, though, uh -huh. and he knows this. And this is one of the reasons why me and him always fall out all the time, bro. Uh -huh. yeah? And it's the fact that yo, if you're wrong, you're wrong. If you're right, you're right. It's that simple. Stop looking. For the ways repose. to try and say, bro, we've all agreed a time in the group. I'm using today as a wait, wait, wait. wait. Okay. I'm using today as an example. Mm. We've agreed a time in the group. It's not about what time do we agree <laughs> to record. What time do we normally do this? Forget about that. It's about the time we've all agreed to be here today. Mm. Yeah, and you wasn't here at that time. It wasn't even close. Yeah. So my main thing is. I'm late. I, I don't even want an excuse. Go I to don't the group chat. Go wait. to the group chat. When you say we all agreed, yeah. 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 Was there a message there that I told you I was getting at 7 o'clock? <laughs> you nah, see loopholes? Brother, I wait, beg you. Wait, I beg you. Wait, wait, wait. Go we, on, you communicate. Right, we, on, we, on, when on. you say we all agreed, yeah. Yeah, did I individually agree with you? Like, oh, wait, did, you say, did you say otherwise when we put the time in there? What are you talking about? Mm. If I have what spoken, you mean, what am I talking about? You know, objection. I've not seen that message. Oh, I swear. Hey, no, so no, should, we, should, we, should we check it now? No, <laughs> you can tell no, you, just, the good thing bro, about WhatsApp, you can talk. Yeah, no, yeah. stop playing devil's okay. advocate. But what I'm evidence. saying, if you say, if someone says, what time are we going to the studio? You uh. got to put seven, yeah? Uh -huh. Bro, I did not confirm to what you were doing. <laughs> because, let's be real. But you read it. No. But let, you read it. Let me show so you. So saying he's busting case for the technicality? Can I say When we have to do something, and we have to take a vote, yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Say we have to record something. He says he can make it. You can make it. Mm. Until I've confirmed and yeah. said I'm down. Uh -huh. Nothing can go ahead. Nothing can go ahead. So yeah. if I haven't said to you, bro, I'm getting there at 7 o'clock, mm. yeah? See you I'm cannot saying. hold me to it. We cannot. See what I'm saying. Yeah. No, no, no. Oh, okay. okay. My, I should be okay. Uh, uh, defend that. Okay. Okay. You defend that. Hey, no, you're yeah, a good lawyer. Yeah, I mean, in, you're, in, you're in your hometown. Your but you know what the problem is? No. Yeah. Uh, 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 can I say something? Yeah. Here's, 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 <laughs> here's. Let me I tell, can't believe what. <laughs> let, me tell, what let me tell you what I think I've read tell recently about realize. life is, yeah? Everybody have their own things they're doing, yeah? <laughs> and he just leaves them to it. Wow. Yeah? It is says that. That is to say. That is to say. Yeah. Well, I'm... When I'm uh, when I'm going through my own uh, things, I don't start calling everyone, disturbing everybody. Uh -huh. yeah. So if there's one, 
two, three, mm. four. Mm. There's four people here setting up. Mm. My assistance doesn't make any difference. Okay. You just want me here just to make you feel like, oh, Uzi was also here. Okay. But you three, four mm. can do this thing. By the way. Same way, if you came in late, I won't say anything. Ah, I don't mind. I'm not. Allah. Bro, DT, there's many times where, where you can, I don't say nothing. Have you, you ever heard me complain? Yeah, you, you complain to me. No, I'm not. <laughs> What? This guy's Bro. a liar. Marvin, Marvin, wait, wait. Mm. wait. Mm. Has he come late? And I complained before. Listen, that one what? I can't no, no, confirm no. or deny. I can't That's, remember. I, I that complain. was London podcast. But what if you I, came late, let me wait, tell you wait, Marvin, wait. If you came late, yeah, I'm not gonna complain. Let me tell you. Something. Unless, yeah, so does that different. mean? Wait, wait, wait. Let me tell you something, yeah. So does that now mean? Oh, because Uzi don't complain when people are running late. It should be a precedent that we should just leave there, so anybody can turn up. <laughs> yeah, because so I so don't feel like bro, turn up come on, bro. They want to turn bro, up. Bro, your saliva is worth a lot. Something is not worth talking about. If oh, I've yeah. come late, then I've come here before recording oh. time. You know so what's what? the issue? You know I love my Ugandan sayings. I'm Say going to bring... I'm going the to bring... Shake the table, you're shaking the table. Uh -huh. This one's a different one. I will one. shake it to the expressive one. drinks. This one they say... Uh, that means Mubara to you. They you to you say Mubara to you. No, too. listen. It means don't bring porridge to a pub, to a bar. <laughs> but why? <laughs> I cannot bring porridge. In the bar, they serve alcohol. Yeah. Yeah. Don't bring don't your bring porridge. porridge. So what this, porridge? As a porridge. As in porridge. Does porridge yeah, belong porridge. in a bar? As in oats. Yeah, as in yeah, oats. What's wrong with me bringing my porridge to the bar? <laughs> the point is, DT has made a very good point about being late. Mm. I think where you are bringing porridge to the argument, yeah. talking about, oh, uh, should I, I'm not here to set up. Da, da, da. The point is, we are grown men. We all have things to do. We are all going through things, right? 100%. I know for a fact, God is my witness. Marvin Molinda lived five minutes away from here and he was late three times in a row. And he was, you were Bro. setting up. You'd be like, oh, what a Sukali thing this. And I just stroll in, sit That's down, right. read Dilemma. You'd be annoyed. I know you very well. You'd be annoyed. Bro. So all it is, we understand things happen. But now this is not a prison. You just so, can't. Be, so maybe I should not confirm anything with no. you. No. Oh my, my God. Days. You should just say, man, them, I'm sorry I'm late. That's it. Like, I don't want you to give me an explanation. I don't mind. You just say, man, I'm sorry, I'm late. And we move. You just want sorry, man. Why, 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 does, why does my sorry do to you? So wait, what, what, what is it? That, that's what, I, don't I don't demand any sorry. I don't need a sorry from you, lot, if you're late. But man needs it from you. When <laughs> but you're why? Late, when what you're what late, does it do to you? When you're, does it make you feel good? No. Like, what, 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 you, know, you know what it does for me? Yeah? What does it do for It you, shows GT, me that you, you've acknowledged that, okay, cool. There was a certain time or certain agreement that was set in place. And I breached that. And because of that, I apologize out of the respect I have for my guys. But yeah, we, that's what that meant. So you just strolling here. We and have if a man just man, says, no, but if a man just says to you, yo, bro, you're late, this guy starts beefing you. He said, What do you mean? What and do you I'm mean? Like, do you know what I've been going through? Yeah, and I'm like, bro, <laughs> I don't care what you've been going through, bro. Do you think uh, for me I care? For me, I won't. For I me, won't, I care. I don't know. But you must no, tell when me. I say I don't care, yeah, like I, know, I mean, I like, like at that, yeah, time, that like, time, I don't need to. Because you said earlier on, oh, should I start explaining? I don't want you to. If you don't want to talk to me about it, I don't want to, but then at least acknowledge that, bro, you're late. Mm. Okay. And that goes for a lot of things. It's not lateness is what we're using today as an example because <laughs> mm. that's one that's happened recently. But overall, it's just that thing, just acknowledging that you know, okay, cool, my bad, innit? Yeah, I'm sorry, bro. Mm. The, 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 sometimes the the whole place would have burnt down, yeah, and it would have taken the news to come back and be like, uh, yeah, yeah, and be like, you know what, yeah, all right, cool. And even with apologies, yeah, Uzi comes with the roadman apology, bro. <laughs> I don't think there's a problem personally, but all right, cool. If you see there's a problem, cool. That's the sorry. What's that? Yeah. That, that's the sorry. That's the sorry. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, bro, I it's don't think it was deep. that deep. It's not yeah, that deep, bro. but if you saw it was that deep, then cool. <laughs> I'm thinking, Ooh. you know what I'm saying? I'm thinking, is that, <laughs> is that him saying You just sorry? take it, innit? And I'm like, you know what? You know we what? move. You just take move. it. But what your sorry does for me by nine, it gives me dopamine. Mm. It has an effect on my brain. Wow. Because it makes me feel like, eh, because you know, man, them, they don't say they love you. Mm, mm. They don't say so they that care. They don't care. They don't say they miss you. Yeah. But when, when your boy apologizes, it's, it's, it's all of that combined. Yeah, yeah, Like you said, yeah, it means yeah. you thought about me, you thought mm. about the, the way you've inconvenienced me and you're like, you know what? My bad. Mm. For me, it does something for me. Mm. Mm. Thanks for listening to the In My Opinion podcast. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share. Until next time, peace.